Hey everyone, okay, so short video today, but I really wanted to share with you this incredibly powerful thought shift that is super useful on the days where you're really struggling with bad body image or really struggling to accept the weight gain that you know deep down is necessary and crucial for your recovery. So on those days when you're noticing the critical thoughts, the judgmental thoughts around your whole body, parts or part of your body, whatever it is, what I want you to do is step back and check in with yourself and say to yourself, my body is not the problem. My body is not the problem. The problem is the thoughts I am having about my body. The problem is the script from where those thoughts are coming. Your body is not the problem. Your body is doing what it needs to do to heal, restore, repair and recover. It is gaining the weight that it needs to gain and that will look and feel like whatever your body needs that to do. It's not the problem. The problem is the judgment and the criticism that is coming from the thoughts you are having about that. And where's that coming from? The script? Well, the likelihood is it's either eating disorder and or diet culture. And so what this does very powerfully is shift you from a place of focusing on changing your body into a place of changing your thoughts. And how do we change our thoughts? By neural rewiring, by shifting our attention and by shifting and changing our actions and behaviours. So what do I mean by that in the context of body image days? On those days, say to yourself, my body is not the problem. The thoughts I'm having are the problem. And then get seriously intentional about changing those thoughts, about attacking those thoughts, about dismantling those thoughts. Look at where you are paying attention. Energy flows where your attention goes. It's such, such a useful thing to remember. The more you pay attention to certain things, the more energy you put into that neural system, the more that gets ingrained, the more it becomes dominant in your thinking patterns. And the same goes for actions. At the end of the day, if you are having a bad body image day, your body is not the problem, the thought is the problem. And so what you're going to do is really seriously focus on shifting that thinking. And the way you do that is by changing behaviours and, and your attention. And when it comes to behaviours, very specifically, that means disengaging from the behaviours which align and support your fear of weight gain, your fear of your unsuppressed body. So it means marching headfirst into that fear. It means saying to yourself, what can I do right now today to show my body through my actions that I am not afraid of its unsuppressed weight, that I am not afraid of the weight that my body needs to gain? What can I do? And when it comes to your attention, it means shifting it from the things which hold you in a place of criticising and judging your body and redirecting that towards a place of trusting and honouring and respecting and embracing your unsuppressed body. Looking at the social media that you're consuming, looking at the content that you're watching, reading, listening to, looking at the conversations that you are paying attention to and having, looking at your self-talk. How are you talking to yourself? And redirecting that attention towards things like, what can you appreciate about your body? What it does for you, the life that it enables you to live. You know, shifting that attention away from the criticism and the judgment and towards acceptance and appreciation and trust. So yeah, basically in summary, the key thing I want to take, I want, so in summary, the key thing I want you to take away from this is the fact that on those days where you are finding yourself criticising your body, judging it, feeling rubbish about your body image, really struggling to accept that weight gain, I want you to remind yourself, my body is not the problem. 
It's my thoughts about my body that are the problem. And in that shift, I then want you to focus your attention away from where your eating disorder wants you to be around changing your body and shift it over to changing your thoughts and changing the script from which those thoughts are coming. Hope that helps.